All right, so um, for today, I figured we'd be playing Cult of the Lamb, which is a game that was recommended to me by my friend, uh, a very close friend of mine. And she said this game is fun. I saw a little bit of gameplay from her. And I believe her. So we're going to give it a go. See how it is. Not sure if I'll do a full playthrough. I'll get through as much as I can today. But we'll see where we go from here. So, without further ado, let's go. Start of the game. Oh. Excuse me, then. A lot of corpses here. Why do I look so sad? Am I gonna die? Lamb to slaughter, huh? Kneel to be sacrificed. Do it. The horror stands the last of its kind. All others we have hunted down and put to the blade. Without this final sacrifice, the prophecy will be impossible to fulfill. The heretic who lies bound below will be condemned to eternal ca captivity. And the old faith shall be preserved. Do it! What? Hey, buddy. The one who waits. Come closer, fear not, for thou you're already dead, I still have need of you. Those foolish bishops those foolish bishops thought they could keep you from me in death, but instead they sent you straight to me. I will give you life again, but at a price. All I ask is for you to start a cult in my name. Do we have a deal? Absolutely, positively. I'm back, bitches. Wait, can corpses reanimate? Oh, no, hang on. Got it. Okay, I got it. Fear not, I am Retu. I was once a chosen vessel like you, but those days are lost to the winds. I was sent to guide you. We are deep in the lands of the old faith and are in grave danger. My instructions are to lead to the safety, continue through the woods, escape lies ahead. I will be close by. Oh, thanks, bud. I could use all the friends I could find here. The lust for gold is oft all consuming of one's heart.
jump over here. Oh, can jump. Can they hide? I feel like they can hide. These guys take a while to charge up. Gotta... Woo. Did I not take damage here? Got it. Guess that might be the end. It's a bad one, bad we have nearly reached safety, but look ahead, another poor soul about to be sacrificed. Rescue them and they should have no choice but to join your new cult. <laughs> O oh, mighty bishops of the old faith, we ask you to accept the sacrifice of this wretched soul. Hey, who interrupts our ritual and trespasses on the sacred ground? Me! Hey, bud. Oh, God, where the hell did I send him? Follower awaits indoctrination. First, let me, um, destroy all this vegetation and wildlife. We have reached safety, you have done well. The Red Crown will allow you to use those markings on the ground to transport yourself great distances. It will take you to a temple that has fallen through ruin. There you will be able to begin your new cult. I will meet you there. Okay, so he's the new Virgil. Cool. Ironically, this is an after Dante's Inferno, so this is pretty cool. Heretics defeated. Cleanse the non-believers. Another five minutes. Sweet. Click difficulty. Easy. Recommended for casual players looking for a fun, accessible experience. Medium. Recommended for modern ed players looking for a well-rounded experience. Hard. Recommended for experienced players looking for a challenge. Recommended for players with a death wish. I'm gonna go for hard. I like to challenge myself. This hollow ground, which once was mine, is now yours. This crumbling ruin will be the site of your new cult. We have much to do. We begin by indoctrinating this poor soul into the warm embrace of your cult. Followers can gather resources for you. Order this one to collect lumber or stone. Hey, buddy. Please spare me. Your name will be Yarn Abri. Uh, shit. What do we call him? Randomize it. What the fuck? Arna, let's go, Arna. Change form. Color. Variant. You get to have a tattoo. 
heals 15% faster when sick and in bed rest. Cool. Oh. Okay. Arna, that's your new name. Huh. Welcome to the cult. You can collect stone. By your hand, our cult will grow powerful, but your followers cannot live on prayer alone. They must eat. Gather our necessary resources and build a cooking fire. It will allow you to prepare meals for your followers. How do I collect lumber? Oh, I can mine. Oh, I can just hold it. And this is why I'm forcing them to do it. Okay, I see it. Build a cooking fire. I guess I can build it. Let's put it in the middle. Like right around here. Oh, wait. Oh, I see the tiles. Okay. Right there. Sweet! Your followers need to eat, and it's up to you to provide meals for them. The hunger of your cult can be seen in the top left of the screen. When this gets too low, followers will begin to starve. And find, move, find more food while proceeding. Pick roots that pass through foraging locations. Plant farms to grow your own food. Seeds can be purchased or found while crusading. Okay, good to know. Camille, I think I have some berries. I need six. I only have three. All right. Okay, now I can cook. There we go. It's a bad apple, but now we must build the shrine. But first, we will need more followers and more gold. Both of which can be found when crusading through the lands of the old faith. Our mutual benefactor, the one who waits, has been trapped by the four bishops of the old faith. Each of them guards a chain that binds him to the realm beyond. We have conjured openings to their realms. It is your task to track them down and slay them so that he may be freed. Now go. There, sh there you shall find gold and willing recruits, and for those who are not willing, convert them by force. Okay, so kind of like telekinesis. Or just evil. Whatever. Alright, I have no idea how long these parts are going to be. 20 minutes? What do you guys say? Let me know in the comments how long do you want these episodes to be. But for now, I have to check the recording. Alright, after a two hour uh, audio check, I think we're good to go with more lamb. Okay, cool. They deposit resources. Okay, I think we're ready to go. Oh, wait, there's a chest here, I think. What is that? I think this is the chest that they put the stuff in. Let's go! Okay, I can go to the left. Darkwood. There's one follower. Okay, I see. You have to have a certain amount of followers to open up different gates. One requires nine. How much does the main one require? Doesn't tell me. Uh, that one requires seven. That requires twelve. Okay, got it. What does it say? Here, godly spilled was blood. Here, godly blood was spilled. Here, the deaf no longer wish to wait, and that's it, that's all she wrote. I wonder if the game is randomly generated. No idea. Two things to health. Sweet. Crusader's Blade 1. A stalwart companion to the Wandering Warrior, a well balanced blade dealing modern damage.
the fire engine dripping? It's like the binding of Isaac? Ow, what? What are you? No, oh, okay, take another heart of damage. I suck. Whatever, we're good. Ow, it's so hard to tell where you are. No damage. Ooh. Okay, cool. Hey, guy. Praise the land, conduit to great power, promised liberator of the one that waits below. So the card showed me once, many lifetimes ago, or has that yet to be? I have always drawn your cards, Lamb, and yet this is the first. Take these cards and I will draw another each time we meet. When drawn by me, they will grant you power. What power? Well, that is both known and unfathomable. The cards, they shall decide. A blue heart. Death store. All enemies have dealt two damage. I kind of want that. I'll take that. All is as it should be, as it ever was, as it always will be. I got another heart. Worth. What I get? Disease heart. This damages everything on screen when hit. So it is like the Binding of Isaac. Which way do I go? Go here. Oh, hey, bud. Are we all the players in the game chance? I'll take the one point damage. Fates have spoken, who will listen? Fight the boss. Those, those are practice dummies. Oh. Oh, ow! Are the bonuses only for this level? No idea. Hey, hey. Wait, I'll take it. How can this be? Who put to the blade? Lamb, as all your kind were, and yet you stand here before me unrepentant. This crown has power, could it be? But I'm stronger still. Turn tail and run, little lamb. Oh. Get back here and say that to my face. little lamb my followers are willing to do anything for me can you say the same of yours I give myself to the cause of mighty leader by the blood of the great ones destroy the red crown is he gonna turn to a boss now oh oh what the fuck is that oh Ooh. oh ow
say I do double damage when they get the one heart. Please spare me. I will see I will follow your teaching safely. Oh. Later. Hey. Who's follower form? Isn't that kinda of useless? I'll take the lumber. Ooh, coins. Nice. Okay, I'm a quarter of the way there, it seems. Return to gold. God, I'm bloody. Woo! Heretics defeated. Cleanse the non-believers. Out of six minutes. Not bad. Well, close. I don't know about you guys, but I could really go for a thing of fries right about now. I'm relieved to see you made it safely, and you have not returned alone. You have convinced more to join our fateful flock. Let us indoctrinate this new convert so that we may continue. Hey, buddy. Experiment? He can say as he is. Loses 5 faith whenever another follower dies. Minus 5 faith when a follower sacrificed. Gotta keep in mind he's not he's not on board with sacrificing. You my friend can collect rubble. Just like a friend here. Followers who either work or worship. Worshipping followers generate devotion for you to collect. But to collect devotion you may require a shrine. Build a shrine? Nope, not you. Get to the thing. A shrine. It costs 30, and I guess we can just put that in the middle. Well, there's an option. They're building a shrine for you guys to worship me. Praise be, your followers can now worship you. Here's a new follower, assign him to worship at the shrine. Then collect the devotion of your followers generated at the shrine to unlock the dev divine inspiration. Wait, where the hell did you come from? <laughs> 10 faith from falling ill. 15% harder to level up. These all sound very, very bad trades. Wait, no. Oh, okay. Oh, like a church. I guess I can only build one. I guess we can build that at the very top. Not on the way. Okay. I think like, right there is good. On the way. <laughs> Temple is the center of your cult. From there you'll preach sermons to grow stronger and perform rituals to mold the fragile minds of your followers. <laughs> You are responsible for maintaining the faith of your cult. If it falls too low, your followers will descend against you and eventually leave. Your followers are ready to hear your word. Show them that you are a great leader. Preach a sermon from within your temple. Alright, hear ye, hear ye. Hear my word. Your faith of your followers grew go stronger. 
fire from them and allow you to new abilities, weapons, and curses. Good. Followers with a higher loyalty level generate more devotion, therefore the more followers you have and the more loyal they are, the quicker you will gain new abilities. Super. What's that one? Permanently gain half heart. Oh, so permanent upgrades, huh? Thanks for the love, guys. You're amazing to behold, the natural leader, I can see why you were chosen. If you're to guide your told, you will need to declare doctrines so that they may obey you. Return to the lands of the old faith and seek out commandments, stone fragments. With these, you'll be able to declare new doctrines. Let's hop a tree up first. 